Hey there, folks. If you've been reading my posts about Dirk's uh, autographs, you would have come across these um, pre-rookie samples where he spells out his um, full name. Um, these were from Germany, and I tried to um, send them to Beckett Authentication, but unfortunately, they were returned inconclusive. I reckon because they don't have samples of this particular autograph to compare to. Um, just to compare, um, this is how Dirk signed from around 98 to 2002. So definitely shortened from his uh, pre-rookie autographs. And from 2002 onwards, he shortened it further to what we um, see now in his modern autographs. All right, so... I've been trying to get some conclusive evidence of Dirk actually signing this way. Um, unfortunately, I've only been able to um, see photos of uh, this particular autograph, but not really that conclusive until today. So I was watching Amazon Prime's uh, Game 7 uh, documentary series. So it um, highlights the best uh, Game 7s ever played and episode three um, shows us the matchup between the Mavericks and the Spurs uh, back in 2006 during the Western Conference semifinals. That's one of the most epic um, Mavericks games ever played and this episode heavily focuses on Dirk's growth as a player and the struggles of uh, Europe European players back in his time and Look at what I saw. On top of that, he's representing the rest of the globe, whether he wants to or not, and he's been labeled soft or... All right. Not it. really that clear with my recording, but you can check out the episode for yourself. But as you can see here, Dirk definitely signs his full name. All right. Um, and there's another... Um, Clip some more. There you go. 1120. Look at that. That's how he signed his um, autographs prior to joining the NBA. This was actually um, taken while he was at the um, Dallas airport um, leaving um, after he was invited to uh, Dallas for the, his very first uh, pre press conference. Um, so definitely before the um, playing for the NBA. So conclusive evidence of um, Dirk's pre-rookie autograph. So I'll try to send this to Beckett and hopefully they'll be able to authenticate it this time. So that's it. Um, watch this episode if you can. I would highly recommend it. Cheers.